This was a weekend of a couple of firsts for me. Uh -huh. It was my first time ever at the Kentucky Derby and my first time ever doing red carpet interviews. That was your first time, Kelly? Yeah, really? I'd never done that before. Oh, really? Wow. Yeah, it was very exciting stuff. Who'd you interview? I interviewed all sorts of people. Uh, Nick Lachey and Vanessa Manillo were there. Really? The first weekend away from the babies. Ruben Studdard. I talked to Star Jones. Neo. Ooh. Yeah, and of course, you know, I'm with Dish Nation, and we always have to ask the hard-hitting questions. Uh, the members of Dish Nation had to uh, have a, a foot race. Which one would win? Hmm. Ricky Smiley's a, uh, you know, he's, he's a slender guy. I feel like he can move real fast. I think, yeah. I think Gary with the team might have a little spring in his step. You might be right about that. You All might right. be right. Big Al, he's coming in the, in the rear. <laughs> Are you uh, serious, what? Kelly? I'm sorry for the phrasing of that. Your own teammate right here next to you, and you give me... Behind Gary? Uh -huh. That's all kinds of messed up right there. I also talked to NASCAR driver Brian Vickers, but I have to be honest, I was more familiar with his acting than his race car driving. Hmm. What's the next race coming up for you? Well, I'm out for a bit with uh, blood clots, unfortunately. Oh, that's reason. right. Yeah. I did. Were you in that commercial? But I had a blood clot on my leg that could have traveled to my lungs. Yes. That was you on that TV commercial with those other people with blood clots. No, yes. Bomber, yeah. That's it. Yeah. That's so funny. I just saw that on TV. Yeah. I knew you looked more familiar than just for racing. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> you in other words, I had no clue who he was. Oh, Kelly. <laughs> oh, my God, you're the blood clot guy from TV. <laughs> Uh, point is, you recognize him, Kelly. Well done. Eventually. <laughs> and the winner of this year's Bachelor, Whitney Bischoff, was on the red carpet. Of course, we had to talk about Farmer Chris. I have to ask, can I see the ring in person? Oh, my gosh. Get a close-up of that. It probably needs to be shined a little bit, but looking good. So <laughs> once Dancing with the Stars is behind you, yes. you can actually buckle down and start wedding planning. Or have you already started? No, not yet. I mean, right now we're just very focused on, you know, dancing and bringing home that Mirabal trophy. And um, after that, you know, once we get back to just reality, it's just kind of been a whirlwind. You know, I think that we'll start talking about it then. You know how I feel about that bachelor farmer. <laughs> <laughs> Dang! <laughs> Let the woman get four feet away before you fall um, out. I'm going to tell you right now. For those of us smoke. who don't know, how do you feel about the bachelor party? Holy <laughs> smoke! But I'm going to tell you right now, they are not getting married. Why? I wouldn't be surprised if they're already done and she's just having to keep up the front until yeah. he gets past the dancing competition. Why I, didn't, I didn't see the gleam in her eye. You didn't see the gleam in her eye. You didn't see the gleam in her ring. Ooh, what's that? That ring was dirty. Okay. And I'm going to tell you, every new, newly engaged woman, oh. all she does every day is clean that ring. And she knew she was going to be on the red carpet. She knew all everybody was going to ask her is to see the ring. And it was dirty. It had, like, hand lotion on it. She is not still engaged to that man. I'm telling you right now. Can everyone do Kelly's face? <laughs> Holy moly! <laughs> Hello there, beautiful Dish Nation fans. You like what you just saw? Go ahead and subscribe to our channel. We have a whole lot more to make you feel all good. Yeah. So good. Hey, just, just hit that subscribe button. I'm going to keep doing this. It's going to get real awkward. I don't even know how to wink anymore. Just freaking subscribe. <laughs>